Dear ladies and gentlemen, I welcome all of you to my channel AMZ for some Bioshock playthrough. Yes, that's right, ladies and gentlemen. Zauberhaft is back in Bioshock Infinite. And we are going straight onwards. What is that? What was that? I'm not sure about the mosquitoes and the uh, port prosperity. Oh, these guys are leaving for good. They have had enough, bro. <laughs> yeah, and I'm just trying to buy myself a little bit of time to break some bits of news to you guys. First of which is that I have just injured my right hand index finger with a razor and it's bleeding quite badly. So that means it will be a lot more difficult for me to deliver those fancy headshots I love to do so much. And additionally, I'm looking forward to getting rid of that repeater weapon because I I don't think that will be of any use to me in a following battle or any of the following battles. So let us see what I can do. What do you got, rich boy, huh? You take it off. What's this, a monocle? What about her? What is happening around here, eh? Sorry, buddy! Whoa, whoa, whoa! <laughs> you, you see how inefficient that goes right now? I'm not sure if I was uh, supposed to start playing in the first place because I am supposed to deliver shots with the injured head. finger. It did not go well after I... Uh, whoa, whoa, whoa! J just look at that! Just look at that! That smells of something roasted. Sorry, mister. Oopsie. I'm, uh, I'm supposed to remember these guys are... Uh, I don't know. They're armed to the teeth. They literally have a lot. I mean, they are armed with repeaters. So uh, one shot like that, boom, gets like a 70% shield down one shot, so I'm supposed to watch out. Yeah, yeah, that's right, I'm here. Probably I'm supposed to get the volley gun myself and get rid of these guys as soon as possible. Come on, come on, come on, do that. Well. Yeah, mine. Remember to use your vigors, that's what I'm doing currently. Anyways, what is happening around? I know that there are lots of these guys out there. Just dead lot of them. If I go out there immediately, I will... Oh, yeah. I, I, I don't even really want to mention what will happen if I go there directly. I will be waltzing around this place like that just until I am 100% sure I can take on these guys without the risk of being murdered savagely. This is something they do perfectly. Mosquito, come! There we go. Gotcha. Super! Uh, looks like I've got the volley cannoneer. <laughs> I mean, the one armed with that very gun I'm holding right now. Most likely, this particular weapon is going to be a greater friend to me, since it is not that comfortable for me to deliver headshots right now. I really wanted you to be advised. Whoa, I just actually died one shot. Oh, that went well enough. Maybe I will uh, take out one more guy like that. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You see? You see? One mere shot. And I'm already, like, <laughs> on alert. My screen is breaking into tiny bits and pieces of broken glass, warning me that I'm supposed to watch out before I absolutely Go ahead. get rid of my life of my own volition. You see how quickly that goes. 
they just they just said goodbye to that mosquito thing sorry and you too whoa 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 and, and these guys are armed with uh, not sure another version of uh, machine gun I mean hey it's much more comfortable for to me well it seems to me like that I'm supposed to call these things machine guns and it would be much more comfortable for me if they actually come over here in the first place because they're kind of really far and it's not going to be that easy to take on them Open it. yeah okay oh come on stop it <laughs> I am at odds, but still, it is not going to be that easy destroying me. I don't really believe there are only two guys right now. There he is, there he is. Ah, I will chase you to your hideout wherever you go. No. Where are you going, guys? Yeah, got him. I totally got him. Okay. Do it. There. There we go. It is not going to be that difficult if I don't make pathetic mistakes. Look. <laughs> Look here, ladies and gentlemen. This mister is kind of persistent too much. Get me some more mosquito. And I'm ready to take on these two. Think you're covered. He's reloading. I'm going to assault him directly like that right now. Sorry, mister. What is that mosquito busy with? Burst gun. This is what it is, uh, what it is called. Burst gun, eh? Let us see. Let us see what that burst gun is made of. I know it is not that easy to aim with this particular burst gun. Hey, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. The most convenient kind of weapon with me in this particular game is the weapon that deals the most damage off of one shot. And these kind of things include carabines, hand cannons, maybe a pistol, if nothing else. But, hey, this particular gun delivers three shots per one mouse click. Now, what is this thing? This is not a volley gun, like a super... Sh I'm super sure of that. What does this do? Is that any different from uh, the other type of gun I have? This one? I don't think so. Okay, uh, why do you care about this particular person? Like this one, this one. I think neither of them really wanted that. I don't really think even those armed Vox Populi terrorists really wanted something like that. Wish I could help them, but hey, I can't, really. They raised up their weapons, so it's either me or them. The one who starts the war gets really a Hobson's choice over there. In the bird. It always has. When I was younger, I used to be excited when I heard it. Excited? He was all I had. He fed me. Got me books. He was my friend. Friend? Until I grew up. Oh. And I hated him. Because he was my warden. But he's just Comstock's pet, isn't he? Just like me. Mm, nope. Done. I really uh, would like to 
dispel your illusion here, Elizabeth, but uh, you are actually quite the opposite of Songbird because you do not obey your father. You are walking with me right now. That's where no better than Comstock. Was she? Oh, God. Once people get their blood up, it ain't easy to settle it down again. This is on our hands, isn't it? <laughs> so, Comstock is still in the list, but... Let, let's see what it is over here. Fink. Fink is dead. Saltonstall. Uh, yeah, that's a kind of reference if you don't know. If you if you know, just... Okay, you are cool. You're really uh, devoted fans of uh, Bioshock Infinite. So, y y you may go out there, Google it for all I care, <laughs> and see what the hell does Saltonstall name have to do with this particular universe. Marlowe. I'm not sure who that guy is. V Vanderwall. H. Clark and uh, who else? Flamber... whatever. So, uh, that's a clear-cut evidence that all these six guys are dead. And not just dead, they're most likely savagely murdered by the Vox Populi. And yes, I absolutely agree on the fact that they are not, not the slightest bit better than Comstock, all things considered. Now, Vending Machine offers me new upgrades for Vigors. This is something I should consider all by all means. So, Charge Aid. Adds brief invulnerability on attack and recharges shield. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is something I will get for sure. That will aid me a lot. The charge aid will aid. Cross boost. Increases stun duration. Looks like I'm supposed to get that as well. And shock chain. Ends the ability to chain lightning strikes from one enemy to others. And I don't have the money to buy that, so I will get the Murder of Crows by all means. Because I'm using that a lot, and if it lasts longer, I will only be happier because of that. And what is that now, dollar bill? The least... Uh, <laughs> the least... useful thing out there. Something I care least for is the dollar bill vending machine, because it basically sells ammo only and supplies. I'm feeling comfortable with finding supplies all by myself. More money. Cash. Sure. Oh, God. Uh, <laughs> I, I remember her looking at me in a serious fashion, but now, by all means, it's all the way even worse. Elizabeth! On it! Because now she's looking serious. What is this thing now? I hope something useful. I have not been getting useful pieces of gear so far. Enemies provide ammo upon death 40% of the time. So, uh... Instead of what? There, yeah, show comparison. Look at that. Increases clip size for all weapons by 75 freaking percent. This is something I got because I have the season pass. And nothing beats that, so... There is no substitute for that. The shotgun? No. But I definitely... Just wait. Wait, a shotgun might be alright. It might be alright. I'm at least a lot more comfortable with the weapons that deliver one shot at a time than with automatic weapons. <laughs> they give me kind of image like uh, as though I'm on a last stand at the moment when I'm uh, just pressing that shooting button and <laughs> unleash the whole volley of bullets actually not even trying to hide from my opponents and basically hoping that they will die before me. Help me out with this lock? I'll see what I can do. Sure, that's uh, the only place we can go right now. Yours. I think. 
or not? What is this heater? Whoa. So that's worthless. Because of uh, the number of ammo it provides along with it. Maybe I'm wrong on that account. But I hope that I will find a carbine somewhere. I will much more appreciate that very weapon. Sorry, buddy. I got surprise for you. Go kill each other for all I care. Boom! <laughs> oh, that was nice. Machine gun, really? They are armed with a machine gun. What? the hell? Aren't they Vox Populi? Aren't they supposed to wield their own weapons? Probably they have looted it. I will make them pay for all I care. I'm sure of that. I'll definitely make them pay for that. They kind of used me. Okay, honestly, they did not. Because this is the very reason why I consider that whole quest a fool's errand just because of the reasons I have specified in the previous episodes guys Booker's definitely messed up all that crap with the universes oh see this definitely did not count on that thing I am most pleased than ever The more I find these things, the more my mood grows. For sure. Was that lockpick even... Uh... I mean, hey. I didn't pay attention whether that lock was worth the whole entirety of five lockpicks. I've not encountered any locks that required more than five lockpicks. Nevertheless... Oh, well, that apparently cannot be opened in this life. Welcome to Emporia. This prophecy business. You don't think anyone can really see the future, do you? Uh, I, I saw something once when, when I first got here. Dream. Patriot, nice. It's New York, but larger than any New York I ever saw. It was burning. One of the prophet's magic is rubbing off on you. Uh, no. I guess I wield enough information right now to say that all that had to do with the tears. By all means. <laughs> oh, probably that was a bad idea. I got a better weapon for these things. United by what? By rage? Whoa, 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 whoa. Easy on that. I will use my fellow patriot to take on you. Oh. Let me take on you now. That definitely disables you for time being. Goodbye. And good riddance to you, sirs. <laughs> Sleep well in hell now seems quite good that my motorized patriot finally got rid of their own patriot how oh, you feel this <laughs> definitely didn't count on that all seems well enough maybe maybe not this weapon is kind of very, very tactical thing, I should say. Polygon. Not that it deals enough damage, it also kind of staggers your opponent for for uh, some time, so they don't really pose any threat to you, which is very nice. Ooh, is this what I'm supposed to grab? A hand cannon. Oh yeah, now I'm strong. Now I feel stronger than ever before. I love hand cannon. Finally, I'm back in this. That was really, really a bad idea to get rid of my fancy carabine. Very nice. Elizabeth. Looks simple enough. And I also think that all those names in here kind of correlate there. a little bit 
with the names of uh, the locations in uh, actual Rapture from Bioshock, the very first game out there. Because hey, one could just say these are the random means of naming the locations, but no. I, let me tell you what it seems to me. Emporia kind of reminds me of uh, Arcadia from Rapture. I mean, the pattern which is used for naming the location. And there is also Fort Frolic that kind of reminds me of Port Prosperity that I have seen before. That is a nice example of consonants and alliteration and everything like that. Stylistic work over here. Not that this game abounds in a nice soundtrack lines it also abounds in a lot of stylistical ornamentation just brilliant that's what i should say i just realized who those two are and they well at least she invented the technology that allows the city to float or uh, yeah quantum particles suspended in space-time at a fixed height so not giant balloons but the thing is <laughs> My book said they disappeared. Definitely not years Booker. Ago. I told you they'd come. No, you didn't. Right. I was going to tell you they'd come. But you didn't. But I don't. Are you sure that's right? Something tells me they're not exactly what they appear. I was going to have told you they'd come? No. The subjunctive? That's not the subjunctive. I don't think the syntax has been invented yet. It would have had to have been. Had to oh, have had, had to have to have to been? Help. They seem to be out of their minds. Odd, isn't it? What's odd? The fact that we sometimes... Finish each other's sentences? Exactly. It would be odder if we didn't. <laughs> How do you suppose they manage that? I'll get back to you after I figure out the floating city bit. Uh... Elizabeth, you better not ask questions like that, because nobody asks you a question. How do you manage to open tears? Come on, Comstock House is up ahead. Probably, since they have invented all that crap, they must be capable of uh, fully controlling it. I mean, maybe they don't really control it by all by themselves, just the way Elizabeth does. But they definitely have the ways to do that. The prophet shall set the throne. He was grooming me, wasn't he? Comstock? Yeah, I think so. Why lock me up? I'm guessing you didn't want to be groomed. Maybe he had something in the works to make you agreeable. Like what? I think it's best we don't find out. <laughs> oh yeah, this is something I was about to say. How does one make another human being do whatever uh, that person wants and as that person pleases thought they'd stay on top of boom 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 <laughs> oh sorry about that fourth power tautology pretended here <laughs> That's not even this guy's like at all. That's for sure. Why didn't these guys die off of one shot? Because that was definitely a kind of a headshot. Anyone who could hear the sound of my voice. Hey, look, lockpick. Where? These Where? Ah, uh, that's a purse. And where is a lockpick? Don't you try to deceive me, Elizabeth. I will discover everything anyway. Okay, right let's open that too. Let me have a look. Done. And what's inside? Some 200 silver Wanna eagles. Hold on to this? Nice. I'm constantly trying to catch the sight of how much money I'm getting exactly by catching that. But I'm still not remotely sure. It seems to me the exact quantity of coins is actually different. All the time. Armory. Do I have the money to upgrade any weapon? I think so. At least I should have. Reload increase. Decreases shotgun reload time. This is something I might need. I will consider that. 
Reload increase. Increases hand cannon reload speed. Very nice. Damage boost here too. And that is... Oh, very nice. A lot of new stuff I really could use. What do we start out with? I guess the machine gun. Even though I'm not using it. I know, I definitely... I'm contradicting myself right now. Hugely, but still. Damage boost for carbine too. I will get the carbine as soon as I can. And damage boost for a hand cannon, I guess, too. Sure. I don't really think I can do anything else with that, but still. Now is the time! What the hell? Oh, that was a very harsh decision out there. You shouldn't have made that. Now, do you regret that? Are you ready to repent, sinners? That was unexpected. But it was all the same worthless. Nice. Finally, I got the carabine. I'm fortified like hell right now. Mr. Comstock, when yeah. we next meet, what of him? It won't be the parlor. See, I went out to that hall of heroes to scalp your false shepherd for you. Turns out, though. DeWitt speaks Sue. He helped me to swap words with this crippled child I've been, uh, looking after. Now, after hearing how the kid has fared in your city, I'm thinking when we take your pelt, I'll let him hold the knife. And now you're dead. Are you happy, Mr. I don't think so. Help me out with this lock. Child's play. Is that guy Got it. the one who was sent to intercept me? What, really? Like I have wasted three lockpicks for uh, barely 150 silver eagles. That must be the greatest of all jokes here. Ah, looks like my injured finger doesn't really prevent me from delivering my headshots that efficiently. Sorry! I know that- Oh! Whoa, 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 whoa! This is the worst place possible to encounter that guy! Good! Good thing I remembered him being actually susceptible to murder of crows. Nicest thing ever. Sorry? Sorry! Basically, I live off headshots, I should say. Emporia, Emporia, Arcadia, then Fort Frolic, Port Prosperity, yeah, yeah, whatever. I'm not surprised that uh, the patterns for naming the locations are actually a lot similar here. That might count as a reference. Well, it does, to me anyway. Yeah, yeah, and that's another reference for all I know about the circus of values and everything like that. Okay, this is the episode that I devote to references. <laughs> Most likely. I have not been paying attention to all that. But I guess if one Found starts to count references in this game Got it. that feature the very first Bioshock game, 
this will be a great number. I'm, I'm not sure that I uh, possess the capacity of counting it properly. Because I really think they are a lot and a lot more. How much money do I have currently? So that's enough for damage boost for shotgun. Not efficient. Pistol. Sniper rifle. Not efficient. Decoil. Yeah, why not get it right away? Why not get it right away? I'm absolutely sure that's going to be useful. I'm using carbine a lot, and I will stick to it. I remember uh, I'm not supposed to encounter a handyman really soon, and if handyman does not oppose me, then... And the cannon and carbine are perfect weapons for me. Your homes are ours, your lives are ours, your wives are ours. It all belongs to the box. Haha! <laughs> and your mind is mine right now. <laughs> You're being so proud of yourself, eh? You are not supposed to withstand the onslaught of Tauberhaf, right? No, I'm still a little bit at odds, but still, that does not make any difference. Come on, guys, get over here. Whoa, uh, have they brainwashed the motorized patriots? They don't remotely look like patriots. Whoa, you know. Your patriots are really bloodthirsty. <laughs> I can do everything just at my leisure when they are bound by the murder of crows. Come on out. Come on out. Really? Oh, now I start suddenly figured stuff out. I have figured stuff out. Good. So Elizabeth only gives me ammo when I'm in the red. When the number of ammo turns red, she will give me at least something. Do it. Okay. Well. Is that guy wearing a hat? Really? No. This is not efficient. Okay. They're trying to hide behind them. Maybe I will... What if I do this? And return to Murder of Crow. Are you coming or what? No, they're not coming. Well, this is something I did not expect. I'm supposed to assault them. Aren't you angry with me? But isn't she dead? You must be missing something. Daisy Fitzroy died. And you are still yelling out her name. That's worthless. Okay, some more guys dead. That's some long-range battle, I should say. Okay. Okay, just recharge the shield. I will wait. It doesn't really make any difference. Well, that takes some time. You're dead. Cover you? Nobody will cover you. Okay. Okay. I have to do that someday! Die! Kill them, my crowies! Oh, some crow dinner over here. Good. And now you too! They're actually really weak. 
seemingly. Really? And I do have one. The way out is to mash your head with bullets. Good. Uh, that's like worst thing ever. Is that all you've got? Let's see. Well, okay, your brother down. And you will go down too. Beast on him, my crows. Sorry. Dance with crows for a little bit of time. No! Don't you dare. Goodbye to you, sir. Looks like it went perfectly well. Sure? Are you sure? I will never regret. I will never regret wasting that thing on you. And that thing too. Let's just waste inefficient ammo on that guy. Haha. <laughs> that looks really funny. And I'm supposed to take on a motorized patriot, but I have a lot of weapons of all damn variety. Which I don't remotely need. Sorry. I love playing cats and mice with these guys. Sure. No, that's a bad idea over here. He's catching up. And I don't really care for Lizzie because if that was kind of real life thing, she would definitely be dead by this moment. Or maybe I actually do care about her so much that she does not die, even in the middle of the battle. My god. I will waste a whole load of ammo before I kill him. But am I supposed to care? No. And he also kind of uh, got zapped by the Tesla coil over here. Which I definitely like. Oh god, and only now I found the pepper grinder. Okay, let it be. Get me my carbine back. Let's loot everything around here. Since that may be called a victory by all means. Well, great. I should say today Elizabeth is very dangerous. She's dangerously generous. <laughs> I'm not even sure why such kindness on her account. Got a lock here. Come on. Something challenging. Oh yeah. Get busy, Elizabeth. All done. Okay. Guessing we've just come to an area to get rid of all our possible lockpicks. Ooh. I just wonder what happens if I go over here and get the RPG to get rid of these guys. Probably not my style. But I could have done that prior to even the starting the battle. Tangled my quantum atom with waves of light, allowing for safe measurement. Sound familiar, brother? That's because you were measuring precisely the same atom from a neighboring world. We used the universe as a telegraph. Switching the field on or off became dots and dashes. Dreadfully slow. But now you and I could whisper through the wall. Ah. Now I see what they mean. So they could talk to each other. Okay. Uh, it just for those who have not figured out it yet. The Lutes twins are not really twins. Because they were born in different universes. And what differs them from one another is just one thing. That one is male and the other is a female. And that's basically all of it. 
in all in all uh, other respects possible they are identical if they can be identical I mean hey uh, if one is a male and the other is a female that might as well tell on their uh, behavior patterns that's what I think very well then what's done is done victory has been committed over here by Mr. Booker DeWitt in my hands and my injured finger too <laughs> that's right ladies and gentlemen I'll see you soon enough in the following episode the following page of my investigation into the case of Booker DeWitt and for now See you soon. Saberhaft 